All right, we got Coach Kent Cox here with us now. The Griffons beat Southwest Edgecombe in their opener by a score of 12 to 2. And Coach, what a spring so far. This is a baseball field. Absolutely, yeah. I, be, I was beginning to wonder if the Lord was gonna ever let us get on it out here. I, you know, I didn't know if us baseball coaches had done something wrong or whatever. But anyway, it was it was finally great to be able to get on the dirt. I mean, Monday we were out here, and uh, and then uh, I, yeah, and you know, and so finally we got a chance to take some real ground balls. I went on and take ground balls yesterday, and I said, man, we're on the dirt. We got to take a chance. So and we we hit one round of live BP, and I thought thought that um. We were gonna come out of our shoes with excitement and everything, but yeah, it's it's been it's been rough, but hey, we, we persevered and done a pretty good job. So, well, the lineup you put out there the days is a lot of names that played JVs last year. You put a veteran on the mound, but the whole uh, more than half the team was a first timer. Yeah, they they were, and we got we got a good nucleus of kids, and we got some good um, you know good seniors with with opportunities as well, and you, and you know, and so that's it's nice to know that you can put a crowd out there like that today and not miss a beat. And so that's what we're, we're looking for. I'm always preaching to them, you're one play away from being a being a starter. So, you know, take advantage of opportunities when you get them. Now, obviously, uh, Blake Helms played uh, pretty good on the mound today going four innings, giving up one hit and only walked a couple of batters. And David Harrison, that like he was a veteran out there getting two doubles right off the bat. Yeah, you know, David's a pretty good good player. And, you know, he's, he's still young, but – he, he does a good job. He knows his limits. He knows what, what he does well and that type of thing and made some good catches in the outfield force. And Blake is a, is a veteran. And he, he don't have to be that guy that don't have to give us that type of outing every night. Will it happen? Hopefully it will. But, you know, everybody has bad games too. But, you know, what I saw today, we can compete as long as he throws the ball like that, that all year. And, you know, and we'll go from there. Well, obviously you've lost a couple to three games already because of the weather and – are you going to be able to catch any of them up? But the biggest problem is when you get to conference play, you don't want to play three anymore, wasting your pitching arms. No, you know, in the uh, North Carolina High School Athletic Association kind of messes up by taking those games out of February. And uh, so you, you kind of forced to play three games a week and not having those, missing those three, um, I don't really want to make them up, but I know that they'll probably, Coach Vincent from Rose will probably give us a call wanting to try and play, they'll play four games a week. And, you know, he's got more, arms to be able to do that and I do but uh, I'm gonna try and avoid making any of those games up if I can and we'll just play play out the rest of the season the way we got it okay congratulations coach Ken Cox a great start to the season a five inning ten run win thank for you. the Griffons thank you so much